case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. In 1997, the New York Court of Appeals heard the case of trustees of Union College v. members of the Schenectady City Council. The case revolved around the idea that a city must balance interests of preserving its historic district with educational interests when establishing zoning laws. The plaintiff, Union College, owned seven properties in a residential neighborhood in Schenectady, known as the General Electric Realty Plot, which was listed on the National Register of Historic Places. In 1978, an ordinance was established that limited property use to single-family residences but allowed educational, religious, and philanthropic institutions to apply for special use permits. However, in 1984, the city amended its zoning provisions, restricting special permit uses to public utility facilities and preventing educational use. Union College challenged the municipality's refusal to provide special use permits for educational institutions within this residential historic district, arguing it was unconstitutional and a violation of their property rights. The court upheld this argument and granted the plaintiff's motion for summary judgment. As a result, the city's law denying educational institutions the opportunity to apply for special use permits in the single-family historic district was deemed unauthorized and unconstitutional. The defendant, the losing party, was required to pay the costs. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit lsd.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.